Hey, 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 welcome to another episode of Sizzle or Fizzle. I am Rick. And I am your boy, Cass. This is the show where we listen to different artists, different genres. We put our heads together. We decide what we like, what we don't. At the end of the day, do we like the track, i.e. Sizzle? Do we not like the track, i.e. Fizzle? We went, uh, <laughs> we went there to the 60s. We listened to Jefferson Airplane. Yep, and you and I mentioned that they had a couple different iterations. Their next phase was Jefferson Starship. The song we're listening to today, Kaz, is called Jane. And if I'm correct, uh, a one Mickey Thomas is uh singing this one. Yes, all right, well, let's get into it. You can already tell the production values have changed from the 60s to the 70s. Listen to them vocals. Change it up on us. Hey. Yeah, Mickey's got range. That sounds like you on the guitar. Brother, I wish it was. Get on that ride symbol. There you go, get that solo, RJ. Very, very interesting. Okay, okay, let me. <sighs> yeah, it's time to unpack this. It's time to unpack this. 
first of all, I have to say, now this song, back when I first heard it and in, in, around that time, this song was okay. The song was cool. The song was all right. But you know, you saw me, I try not to rock and, and, and display mm -hmm. myself on video during the replay. But the reason that I am so into this song now, mm -hmm. you're not a wrestling fan. I am. Right. On, AE, on AEW Wrestling, there is a wrestler that comes out. He goes by Freshly Squeezed. This is a song he comes out to. This is his entrance song. So all this time, mm. when I've been hearing this song, I never put two and two together. And then when you put this on the list, I'm like, oh, son of a bitch. Uh oh, Freshly Squeezed. And he, he comes out. He's real mellow. He's real cool. He wears denim. And he wears sunglasses. And he just puts the thumbs up like this. He doesn't even put a full thumbs up. He just... He's real laid back. And this is the song he comes out to. So I have to say that I, I, I'm digging everything and anything and everything and anything and anything. And I will give this funky because this is one of the 70 songs that is just F-O-N-K-E. -E. Uh, the beat, the vocals, uh, the drums, the guitar solo, everything is everything is everything. So funky there. Uh, I'm trying to hurry along here. We're going to do this will be uh, 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 in the truck playlist. So this is not going to be on anything cardio or anything like that, but it'll be in the truck playlist and I'll give it a sit. Turned over to you. Bye -bye. Hey, um, I think I said it. Yeah, because now that leaves me with nothing to say because I was going to piggyback off of all that. Well, uh -huh. you can piggyback. That means I already said it. So you get on the back and then say everything all over again. Nah, nah, I don't know. I don't know anything about anything about wrestling, uh, <laughs> but I will say this. I had heard the song before, but listening to it again, and this is the reason why, you know, sometimes it's not a reaction. Sometimes it's a review because when you can sit here and you can like just listen to it for the sake of hearing it and analyzing it, you hear things that you didn't hear before, you know, and I've heard the song a couple times before. But I never really gave a second thought to Mickey's vocals. He's got some powerful vocals. And on top of that, I mean, that doesn't even, I'm not even sure. I didn't look at it. I'm, I'm not even sure if that's natural tone or falsetto. But either way it goes, it's it's powerful tenor, high tenor. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know if that's mezzo tenor or I forget the technical jargon, but it's high tenor, alto tenor. I don't know what that is. Yeah, like and, and the bass line for that breakdown Mm. Oh man, that was nice right there. I wrote that. Well, hats off to you, brother, because um Thank you. that was some good stuff there. And, and for those of you that haven't seen, check out our video for uh Jefferson Airplane when we did We did um somebody, somebody to, love. to love. Yeah. Um I mentioned, hey, I want to get all the iterations of them just so. I can hear the production value changes because I you knew that the they word would. iteration. Can you spell that? Because I can't. Yeah. I T iteration. iteration. <laughs> okay, there we go. <laughs> Works for me. But yeah, this is a this is a different sizzle for me because I, I I like this. I I, I I yes, it's a decade after the song that we listened to before, and it's every bit ten years more polished it's definitely yeah definitely we had to change our whole mindset uh between the two so the 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 judgment i don't know i hate to use the word judgment but the, the critique the crit, I don't critique know. i like that that's that's much better than judgment because um, because we didn't hate somebody to love well i mean but it's, it's the the perspective had to be different because of the decade that it came out yeah so we couldn't apply to to uh to jane to to what we listen to with somebody to love so i mean that we did what we had to do you know it, it worked yeah. and everybody get back there and check it out check it out check yeah it out. definitely check that also, out and, i will also put this on a sit and sip i can see that i can because i see can that. see myself just sitting down and doing absolutely nothing and this song i don't have to be moving to listen to this so it'll go it'll go on two playlists there, Damn good song. Is, is that a word, playlists? It is now. Okay, there you go. Let us know what else from Jefferson Starship.
that we should be listening to. Bring it, because, you know, we're not as familiar with them. So let's check it out. Keep it mm. coming. Like, share, subscribe. And until we meet again, stay positive, stay blessed. And keep it moving, everybody. Keep it moving. Later. Later.